What's going on YouTube? Today we are going to be looking into the male hormone testosterone. Its purpose, its importance, as well as ways to increase and or maintain your testosterone levels naturally. Now before we start, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the channel for more health related content. With that being said, let's get into the video. The male sex hormone testosterone is the main hormone in men, but small amounts are also found in women. It is produced in the testicles of men and the ovaries of women and is known as a steroid hormone. Small amounts of this hormone are also produced by the adrenal glands. When young boys reach puberty, this hormone is one of the most contributing factors of the physical changes such as hair growth, gain in a deeper voice, as well as increased muscle mass. During adolescence and in early adult life, testosterone levels increase to about 30 times as much. However, once people reach about the age of 30, it's natural for us to see a 1% decrease in testosterone each year. And what is less known and talked about is how important it is to maintain optimal levels of this hormone throughout your adulthood and even during old age. For adults in particular, maintaining a healthy level of testosterone is important for most things, but specifically disease risk, sexual function, body composition and general health. Also, increased testosterone levels are able to cause swift gains in your vitality and muscle mass. Also in female adults, this hormone also plays an important role in sexual health and well-being. The key roles of testosterone are as follows. A. Muscle mass and bones. B. Facial and pubic hair. C. Development of a deeper voice. D. Increased sex drive. E. General good mood and good quality of life. And finally, F. Verbal memory and thinking ability. You should seek advice from your doctor if you have concerns regarding low testosterone, especially as you age, as it's natural to experience a decrease in levels with age. Some typical symptoms are decreased muscle mass, increased body fat and erectile dysfunction. If your doctor says you have low testosterone levels, hypogonadism or need testosterone replacement therapy and you are interested in trying to naturally boost your levels or if you just feel a boost could benefit you, here is the list of the most common ways that can help you boost your testosterone levels. Number one, resistance training in your workout. Resistance training allows an individual to build a strong and lean muscle mass opting for the use of resistance bands instead of the more conventional ways of weight training. Pushing your muscles to work harder than they normally do creates tears in the muscle tissue. When your body recovers from these tears, the process will cause the muscles to get bigger with each workout. Along with this muscle increase, set resistance training can increase your testosterone levels, as well as also increase your cardiovascular health and greatly reduce the risk of injury outside of the training. There are also some suggestions that this can also have a positive increase in performance in the bedroom. Number two, weight training with compound lifts. Weight training with resistance in itself is beneficial. However, to boost testosterone levels, it is essential to do the right type of weight training. Multi-joint lifts, also known as compound lifts, are said to be the most effective in this aspect. This practice engages many muscles at the same time on both sides of the joints, whereas, as for example, a bicep curl is only able to engage the elbow joint exclusively. Some examples of compound lifts are the inclined bench press, deadlifts, and squats. Number three, losing weight. It is well known that being overweight and or obese can be very dangerous for your health. It is one of the main causes of diabetes, can increase the risk of heart disease and also increases the risk of high blood pressure. As well as these known dangers, being overweight also is said to decrease the natural production of testosterone. Aerobic exercise can be the most effective way to reverse this reduction. Number four, consume more protein. An increase in protein will not directly increase your levels of testosterone. However, you will need to have enough protein in your body to build the muscle needed for the exercise. So basically, the protein increases muscle mass, which then makes the workouts more effective, which in turn positively increases your levels of testosterone. Number five, intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting can also help increase levels of testosterone. 
An example of this is to eat regularly for five days of the week and then eat a reduced amount for the remaining two days. There is evidence that claims that these types of processes can force the body to use your stored fat as energy, which then can increase the levels of testosterone that the body produces. Number six, increase your HDL cholesterol. The bad cholesterol that is known to build up in your body, which is unhealthy, is LDL cholesterol. However, there is also good cholesterol, known as HDL cholesterol, which is said to have a much more positive impact. And there is research that states that HDL cholesterol is linked to positive serum testosterone levels. There is also some research that states that an extensive increase in HDL cholesterol is linked to heart disease. So if this method of consuming HDL cholesterol is something that you may wish to try, you should at first seek medical advice and consult with a professional to keep within safer levels. Number seven, increase sleep. Adequate amounts of sleep are essential for anyone trying to gain optimal benefits from your body. It is absolutely crucial for the recovery and repair process of your muscles. And if your muscles are more healthy, this will in turn optimize the release of more testosterone into your body. Even with this being said, there is still an even greater link between adequate sleep and higher levels of testosterone. Research states that men who do not maintain regular sleep cycles will often experience significant reductions in testosterone levels, regardless of whether they work out. The reason behind this correlation is still inconclusive. However, doctors will recommend patients with low testosterone levels should aim to get around seven to nine hours of sleep every night. Number eight, monounsaturated fats. There is said to be a positive improvement in the body linked to monounsaturated fats and improved testosterone levels. An adequate amount of this particular type of fat is recommended by scientists. Some examples of foods that contain these fats are things like olive oil, avocado and peanuts. This is not to say that healthy amounts of naturally saturated fats should be ruled out of also maintaining a healthy productive body. These are things like egg yolks, dark chocolate, red meats, hard cheeses and coconut oil. Number nine, whole milk. A large amount of the production of testosterone happens during the night while we sleep. Full fat or whole milk is also said to trigger testosterone production. Although you should consult with a medical professional on whether this is suited to your particular metabolism and what amounts would be suitable. Also, make sure to be getting enough exercise to burn off any excess weight incurred. This milk can also help with the release of melatonin, which is a sleep hormone that can help with ease of sleep at night and aid a good night's rest. Number 10, sunlight and vitamin D. Sunlight is a natural source of vitamin D and is essential for the production of testosterone. Even though there are vitamin D supplements that can help with the levels of vitamin D, you should always aim to take advantage of any exposure to sunlight, as this is the most natural and effective way for your body to absorb this vitamin. Broccoli and other vegetables. The digestion of broccoli and other cruciferous vegetables produces DIM in your body. DIM is a concentrated phytonutrient. This phytonutrient can help to increase the production of testosterone and also reduce levels of harmful estrogen. Broccoli is also known for aiding in the prevention of prostate cancer as well as slowing the progression of other potentially cancerous cells. Two other vegetables you should also try to include are cauliflower and Brussels sprouts. Number 12, natural zinc and magnesium. These minerals are necessary for the production of testosterone and can be easily integrated into your routine. These minerals are also commonly missed out on, so a sign that you may be low on them is if you suffer from diarrhea. Also, excessive drinking of alcohol can deplete these minerals as well as not drinking enough water. Fortunately, there are many sources of these minerals that you can consider integrating into your diet, namely crabs and scallops, bran cereals, oysters, yogurt, sesame seeds, pumpkin seeds, and Brazil nuts. Number 13, regular sexual activity. Regular sexual intercourse is known to have an impressive effect on the amount of testosterone your body produces. There are some that suggest that this is because of a boost in libido, but it is in fact because of the amount of aerobic exercise the activity involves. Number 14, stress reduction. 
Stress is one of the biggest contributors to low levels of testosterone. This is because when you are stressed, your body produces more of the hormone cortisol. This hormone's presence is known to have a toxic effect on testosterone levels. People who have problems with testosterone levels are often advised to find ways to reduce the level of stress in their life as a possible solution. Number 15, carbohydrates in moderation. A lot of diet plans will warn you to stay away from carbohydrates, but this isn't always the case when trying to build testosterone. There are studies that claim that individuals with a little more carbohydrates have slightly higher levels of testosterone in their system. The good news is that as long as you're adding enough exercise into your routine, you will use the carbohydrates for energy, which will ensure that you'll avoid gaining unwanted weight. However, be aware that without maintaining a certain level of activity, you will lose the testosterone increase and furthermore, if you begin to gain weight, your testosterone levels will be at risk of dropping even lower than normal. Number 16, staying aware of medications. Even though most people are aware of the medication they use, they do not always know its full effects on the body. It is said that many prescribed medicines can have an effect on testosterone levels in your body. You should always ask your doctor and or read the potential side effects of any prescribed medicine that you are taking to see whether low testosterone is a potential. Some of the most popular prescribed medicines are known to have a negative impact on testosterone levels. Some known medications that can affect testosterone levels are ketoconazole, spironolactone and cimetidine. Chemotherapy drugs, opioids and antidepressants can also have a negative impact on levels of testosterone. People that are using these medications should phase them out and never stop using them abruptly as they are said to have more serious side effects during times of withdrawal. Always consult your doctor before completing any of these medications. Number 17, the use of fenugreek in your diet. Fenugreek is said to be a helpful herb which can help an individual increase testosterone in a few different ways, especially amongst men. But there is also science that confirms it can also have effect on others. Typically, the seeds of this herb are dried and grounded and is regularly included in other recipes, typically wraps and stews, as well as Indian food. Number 18, the power of avocados. Avocados have always been a love it or hate it type of vegetable, but men especially might have more enthusiasm when they realize the effects this vegetable can have on testosterone levels. This is because avocados are high in zinc, which is said to boost testosterone levels in men. So if the taste of plain avocado is not for you, maybe you should try mixing some guacamole in a tortilla wrap to hide some of the taste. Number 19, lowering your sugar. Consuming too much sugar is well known to be bad for you, but it is extremely bad for maintaining a healthy level of testosterone production. Too much sugar causes your blood glucose to increase. This in turn instructs your body to release insulin, which in turn inhibits the amount of testosterone in your body. This is also the reason that most men with type 2 diabetes tend to have low testosterone levels. Carbohydrates are usually recommended in moderation during weight loss programs. But sugary snacks should be limited. Also sugar is sometimes hidden in processed foods, so always try to check the labels. Number 20, consume macadamia nuts. Most nuts can have a positive impact on testosterone levels. However, macadamia nuts are said to have a more beneficial effect. This is because although mostly all nuts are high in omega-3 fatty acids, that are great for delivering high quality nutrients. Macadamia nuts are especially high in saturated fatty acids, which are helpful in the production of testosterone. For those who are not particularly fond of macadamia nuts, a similar alternative to consider are Brazil nuts, which are similar in benefits, but slightly less saturated fats. Number 21, adding more ginger in your diet. Although ginger is said to be controversial in its ability to boost testosterone levels due to lack of evidence regarding its effect, researchers have concluded that testosterone in male animals is said to rise with the addition of ginger. This could be because of an increase in HDL cholesterol as well as increased antioxidants. On top of this, ginger helps to manage blood sugar and helps testosterone to circulate around your body. Ginger is extremely versatile 
and added to many different foods including soups, salads and pasta as well as stir fry recipes and many other dishes. Individuals who are bold enough may even be encouraged to eat it raw as many times this is the best way to get the most benefits from foods. Number 23, purging your toxins. So far, most of the solutions in this list have been dietary, but in order for any of these changes to have an impact, you will need to make sure that your body is relatively free of toxins that can build up in your body. Although your gut is naturally filled with bacteria, toxic and unhealthy bacteria can significantly reduce your ability to absorb healthy nutrients. And if your body is not able to properly digest the healthy nutrients, your efforts could be wasted. An easy way to improve your gut's bacteria is through the use of probiotics. These probiotics help with the metabolizing of food. Microorganisms are needed to use nutrients, which you can get with a supplement. Probiotics are naturally found in sauerkraut, pickles and yogurt, as well as other foods. Number 24, high intensity interval workout. HIIT, which stands for High Intensity Interval Training, is a style of workout. It mixes the short style of high intensity workouts and adds small breaks in between. The aim of this style of workout is to force your body to burn more calories in a short space of time. It can be incorporated into many exercises. For example, a jogging exercise where you are walking at one minute and sprinting the next. The aim of this workout is to put your body in an anaerobic state, which then helps you burn sugar and glucose. This workout has become quite popular in modern times, probably due to people's limited available time for exercise. Number 25, boxing and martial arts. There are many ways to naturally increase your testosterone, particularly with boxing and or martial arts. It is known to be just as engaging as it is effective. By developing more confident and aggressive mindsets, testosterone levels may be able to increase temporarily. Although you may not want to take on a routine that involves you in direct combat with another person, even regular sparring can have a positive impact on confidence and aggression, as well as be an enjoyable and effective way to stay in shape and increase testosterone. Number 26, uh, facing your fears. Many people will ignore problems with their testosterone levels for fear of embarrassment. They experience difficulty coping with the fact that as we age, testosterone levels naturally start to decline. Because they may have become complacent in their routines, the fear of change to their diet and routine can sometimes seem to be a bigger obstacle in our minds. And some people just feel like they're too old to worry about these types of things. But the reality is these changes to your lifestyle aren't just aesthetic. By integrating the right lifestyle choices, men can not only improve levels of testosterone, but overall health can also be greatly improved. Number 27, avoiding soy products. Protein from a typical source is highly encouraged. Individuals that are on vegan diets are more likely to not be getting the right source of protein. So this likely will have a negative impact on testosterone production. It may even have a reverse effect, as it is also said to reduce sperm production. Also, it is said that having too much soy in the body can cause an increase in estrogen. And having too much estrogen levels in your body can make raising testosterone levels virtually impossible. Added to this, your body does not fully absorb soy. So if it is used as your primary source of protein, your body may not be able to reap all of the potential that this protein offers. Number 28, eliminate junk food. Having a healthy diet is a major part of increasing testosterone levels the proper way. It is virtually impossible to maintain a healthy diet if you regularly find yourself at the local drive through Too much fast food and junk food over time can eventually clog your arteries and negatively affect your cardiovascular system. Also, these types of foods will add to the weight your body is already carrying which can possibly reduce testosterone production. Luckily, in recent times, even most fast food establishments have a healthy option available. So most times you can try to opt for some fresh fruit or a healthy salad instead. Having said this, the best way to stay healthy 
is to be organised by making sure your fridge is stocked up with lean meats and other healthy options. By staying organised and disciplined, you'll find it a lot easier to stick to your good habits. Number 29. Eat more strawberries. Strawberries are said to be among the top foods that individuals can use to help increase testosterone levels because of the high amount of zinc they contain. Low levels of zinc can be a significant factor in the reduction of testosterone levels. Low amounts of zinc are also known to put your immune system at risk. As well as help with increasing your testosterone, strawberries also contain a great amount of nutrients. For example, vitamin C, fiber and antioxidants. Also, they don't contain a lot of sodium or calories, which can add to your waistline. Number 30, drinking coffee. Coffee has often been used by many people prior to a workout to give a boost of energy that aids them through. But surprisingly, energy levels are not the only thing that coffee can help raise. Drinking regular coffee can also help to raise testosterone levels. Researchers have long said that caffeine is not great for the body. But recently, it has been discovered that there are actually many benefits. Studies have shown that regularly drinking coffee can help reduce the risk of heart failure, strokes and Alzheimer's. Although it is important not to consume it in excessive amounts, the caffeine in coffee can be incredibly helpful to individuals who are trying to increase testosterone levels. Number 31. Eating oysters. Oysters are said to have an aphrodisiac effect and are even said to be able to improve overall sexual performance. It was later then thought that this could also just be a coincidence as the people who consume oysters generally were said to have a very basic diet otherwise. So on the rare occasion that they were able to eat oysters, it may have had a kind of placebo effect of making them seem so energetic and nutritious. However, nowadays there is scientific evidence that supports the original theory and in fact oysters have been said to improve testosterone levels in test rat subjects. This connection is said to be because of luteinizing hormones as well as an increase in levels of nitrous oxide in your body. Oysters are also said to have many other health benefits, providing protein, vitamins and minerals in a unique way that other sources are not able to do. Number 32 consuming ashwagandha. The herb ashwagandha has been around for thousands of years and was mainly used for people that struggled with infertility. Researchers say it can naturally increase testosterone levels and also promote an increase in your sperm count, which can in turn help to increase fertility. The most common way to consume this herb is with a supplement. However, you can also use this herb as a powder to bake with food as an additional ingredient or in a drink for the same desired effect. Coconuts are said to be high in saturated fats and bodybuilders have been consuming this nutrient for many years to help them bulk up and to raise testosterone levels. A good amount of saturated fat in your diet is great for regulating testosterone levels and coconuts are said to contain up to 90% of this fat. So they are said to be a fantastic natural source as opposed to processed foods. Number 34, dark chocolate. Dark chocolate is often a gift men like to give to their partners, but you might want to consider doubling up on your order and keeping one for yourself. This is because it contains a high amount of flavonoids, which is great for your cardiovascular system and can lower the risk of heart disease. Although by itself, it does not significantly raise testosterone levels. Having a healthy heart is the key to maintaining any kind of strenuous physical exercises, which will go on to help you manage testosterone levels more effectively. Number 35, cooking with olive oil. Olive oil has often been referred to as a healthier alternative to other types of cooking oil. High quality olive oil is not only more full of flavor, it can also help you to manage HDL cholesterol levels, as well as increase levels of testosterone. Did you know that before you are born, testosterone is responsible for determining your sex as well as the development of your sexual organs? A good diet and a healthy, active lifestyle can impact your hormonal health as well as your testosterone levels. Staying physically fit and consuming foods that are nutrient-rich are an essential part of this improvement. You should especially try to consume more vitamin D, magnesium, 
flavonoid antioxidants as well as zinc. Try to stay healthy YouTube and I'll see you on the next one. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more health related videos.